total of 36 shortlisted candidates had the opportunity to convince the panel on their qualification for the post that are required by law to be filled a year before the general elections. I left not because I didn't want to be part of a... Elizabeth Muli, chair of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission interview panel, kicked off the evaluations that seek to fill four commissioner slots in the important national body for one final time. Welcome to your oral interview. I will request the panel members to introduce themselves to you so that you know who will ask you questions this morning. Director of Research and Support at the Kenyatta University, Richard Oduro, served the opportunity to present his resume in person. Oduro marked out his intention to apply innovation and his skill in research so as to boost the Commission's performance. Would you advocate for mandatory voting in Kenya? I would in the morning to insist that let everybody actually go out there and vote. Then they have the right to query. Of the population that, um, that have some uniqueness, uh, they include women, they include people with disabilities, if she was in office, Dr. Rose Mbua told the panel that sensitization on the forthcoming general elections would be active, civic education and innovation being tools she would put to maximal use. Um, my resignation uh, from the Law Society of Kenya was not a bolt in the rain. It was not a, fl uh, a hasty decision. It was a critical ethical decision that I made after great introspection. Rosalind Aviambo Odede closed the curtains on the exercise, declaring her comprehension of the office she pursued while submitting her reasons for resigning from the Law Society of Kenya at a turbulent time, simultaneously defending graft accusations against her. I left not because I didn't want to be part of a failing institution, but out of a sense of responsibility and accountability to the members, because I feel the council has lost the legitimacy to continue to be in office. According to Article 136 of the Constitution, all commissions officers should be filled a year before the general elections. The ball now lies in the panel's court as they determine and submit the names of the qualified to President Uru Kenyatta for the IBC to have a complete structure as the 2022 polls come calling. Emmanuel Kutosi, KUTV.